Hi everyone, it's Chris here from Retro Consoles UK and today we have something a little bit different. So we have a big pile of PC Star Wars, big box PC Star Wars games. So we'll go through them, there's about seven here. We'll go through them, we've also got some Star Wars figures which we'll show at the end. But it's the PC big box games I really wanted to show you. Starting off, so we have Episode 1, Phantom Menace. By Lucas Arts. So we'll look inside. So inside we've got the CD ROM. Really nice condition there. And we've got the manual to go with it as well. So that's really nice. So that's episode one, Phantom Menace. We'll see what else we've got. We've got Star Wars Supremacy. Another big box game. Again, by obviously by LucasArts. So we have the CD ROM there. We've got Meteor Manual there. Big old manual there. Big thick one there. It's really cool. And the box art is really nice as well. Star Destroyer in the front. So that's really cool. So that's Supremacy. We've got, wow, this is a really big, oh, this isn't a game. I thought this was a PC game. Chewy, I think this is a board game. I asked all the old big box PC games, and yes. So this is an adventure game, including everything you need to play. Two or more players, age 10 and up. So there is. A Hasbro Chewy figure in there, really cool. The dice you need. This thing's never been used, so it's got the playing pieces that you need there. If anyone ever played this game, let me know. So the playing pieces are there. The map is there, or the playing board is there. Special edition. Subscribe now, gamer. The instruction or the rule book for the game. And more instructions. This is really cool. I didn't realise this was in there. I thought this they were all big box PC games. So that's really cool. Something slightly different. So if anyone's played it, let me know. I think it's mid-90s. Let me get back in here. I think it's mid 90s if it's Hasbro. I could be wrong. 2000. That's from 2000. So pretty cool. Yeah, something different. So next we have Star Wars Jedi Knight. Dark Forces 2. I do like these big box PC games, they display really well. The box art on them is really nice. So again, as with the other ones, the CD-ROM itself there. We've got the instruction manual and a poster for four games, some other games. So that's really cool. Another one there. So that's Jedi Knight, big box, PC game. Got another one there. So this is Star Wars Behind the Magic. So inside the guide to Star Wars, in exclusive interviews and stuff. This is pretty cool. This is not really kind of a game as such, I suppose. It's more behind the scenes and information about how they made the movie in, in interviews and stuff. So let's see what's inside. So it's the CD ROM there. Some discs. That's a vehicle special edition, and this is the disc for the actual game. Nice, nice manual there as well. So that's really cool. That's different from just like a, a game to play. A bit more information, and that's really cool. So that's them. We do have two more. I'll say the best one, which I think is the best one till last. So this is Mysteries of the Sith. So this is an add on to. To Jedi Knight, so this is an add-on to this one. So you need to have that one. So it's extra missions like expansion pack. 
So we get CD-ROM manual with that, really nice, and more information inside. So that's really cool. So the last one as well, I'll we'll look at. This is the one. This is the reason I bought the lot was for this one. So this is Star Wars Shadow of the Empire, big box PC game, really cool, really sought after game. If I can get into it. So fortunately this one doesn't have the manual. No, but it does have the CD-ROM game. It doesn't have the manual, unfortunately. Unless it's a smaller manual inside. There is a manual inside, so that is a manual there. So really cool. Shadows of the Empire. I also picked up some figures as well, so I'll show you quickly what I've got you here. So you picked up the first one I was really happy with. So this is Electronic Heavy Blaster. Really cool there. You can hear that. Sound effects are still working, so that's really cool. Hand solos. Never been out of the box. Brand new from the day it was from playing from the shop. So that's really cool. We have this one. So this is Jabba's Palace with Han Solo. Brand new, never out of the box. Still sealed, brand new, never out of the box, which is really cool. We have another one, brand new sealed. Yep, sealed both sides. So this is the dancers, Jabba the Hutt's dancers, which is really cool. Interesting, I've never seen this before. So I thought that's pretty cool. Another one, all these I think are brand new, yet yeah, all these are brand new, never opened, which is super nice. So this is Ronto, is that how you say it? Ronto and Jawa, the little Jawa's in there. So here comes the Ronto. So that's it there. Really cool. Got this big one. So this is really nice. So this is Endor attack again sealed never opened really good quality amazing figure quite sought after this is quite a rare one as well so I'm super happy to get this brand new sealed in the box we have micro machines one so I've done really well with the micro machine stuff I had some of the bigger stuff as well which is all sold out again this one this one's been opened but hopefully it looks really good inside. Has it just been opened? Let's have a look inside. Minty fresh, still in the poly bags. Comes with its instruction manual there, obviously. The figures up top. This is minty never used minty fresh everything's in the bags brand new the day it was born so that's super cool we've got one more one as well which i thought was really cool another big item so this is darth vader's tie fighter this again does look like it's been opened but maybe new let's have a look inside Instruction manual, the TIE Fighter itself there, or parts of it, and the wings, so brand new, in the box, never used, never played with. Really amazing. So what did you think? Have you, do you have any of the Star Wars stuff yourself? If there's anything you want to add to your collection, let me know. We can definitely send it out to you or we can do local pickup. Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you next time.